The ISS National Lab was developed to promote really innovative research. And there's really no better highlight in our work over the years than the kind of research that is coming out of Mass Challenge. Like Mass Challenge, which is a business incubator, the International Space Station can be a, a business incubator for research and development in the ecosystem of space. Maybe space has a place, right, that can further your business interest and make you successful. We're developing a novel bone adhesive biomaterial. I think it gave validation to a lot of investors along the way, and it helped us raise a pretty substantial amount of capital. By studying this condition up on the space station, we were able to sort of accelerate the learning profile. Our relationship with Boeing and the ISS National Lab has deepened since our time at Mass Challenge. Boeing became a really instrumental partner in operationalizing the genes and space competitions, where students in middle school and high school propose experiments to be done in space. This will only continue to grow as we go further into space, as we you know, go back to the moon, and these tools become pivotal to ensuring safety while we're there. In our case, uh, it happened to be an astronaut who was also MIT trained, who was a former U.S. Navy SEAL. Everything went smoothly, everything went, went perfectly. It's just a very surreal thing for me to think that in a year or two, real astronauts will be working with technology that I built and I'll be able to watch that. Mass Challenge is really a perfect partner for us and a great opportunity for us to have access to organizations that might not otherwise know that we exist. The value Boeing gets out of this in our partnership with the National Lab and, and Mass Challenge is really access to this new community. The startup community is, is really rich with ideas, full of innovation. It has worked better than I could have ever imagined.